guys, how's it going? It's a height here, and we're back with a brand new episode of Autonauts the Mega Edition. And guys, today I think is the day we get this warehouse going for our clothes. And I still haven't really figured out how I want to do this. I just remember there being a lot of clothes, and there's going to be more. So, yeah, there's a lot. A lot, a lot, a lot. So there's 10 in each one of these rows, which leaves me with 20, 40, 60, and then 2, 4, 6 more. 66 items of clothes right now, and then if I come over here, uh, another 10... Is this another 18 more? Another 20? So we're up to 86 items of clothes? 86 items of clothes, guys! Oh my god, we're gonna need a massive room for this. A massive room. So... I don't really know the best way to do this. It's gonna be a mess because each item uses a different clothing things so hang on perhaps the best the best way I can see to do this is we plunk down each table and we see how many things get made in each one. Oh, you guys hear that it's my little reminder bot I knew this was gonna happen it's a good thing we have him set up let's go take a look at our next job for this guy um Crude spades, easy. Crude bot backpack upgrade, easy. Cotton raw, easy. Yo. Hey, that's pretty good. Let's do it. So 49 crude spades. Where do I want to go? I don't need you to go to berry pie raw anymore. I said, I said 49, right? Did I say 49? Yes. Okay, I want you to move to my crude spades, wherever they are. Uh, wait, do I not have crude spades? Oh yeah, crude spade. Okay. Take from crude spade. Perfect. That one's done. Then I want you to go to Crude Backpack. Repeat. Uh, can I copy this whole thing? Yes. And I need you to do that 45 times. And my Crude Backpacks are here. I just started making some. Here we go. Now I need to copy this one more time. And I forget already what it was. It was cotton, but 62 of them. It's such a random number. 62. Is it cotton seeds? No, raw cotton. Well, that one is going to be pretty easy to do, isn't it? There we go. Go do your thing. I wonder if I should move it closer to the spades, maybe. Put it over there for now. He's gonna start running super far at some point. If I remember, I'll move it again. If I don't, it's not a big deal. He's gonna just continue to do that by himself. Oh, guys. You might notice something on the screen right now. If you're really, really bright. If you know what I'm saying. <laughs> Look over here. I have started making decorations for our base. <laughs> I'm so excited for this. So we've got a whole bunch of lights. I've got um, aquariums, which I have to put fresh water into because I don't have a construction bot for fresh water, which I mean, I don't think I'm going to make one, honestly. Um, we got some castle bridges, some castle towers, and some castle walls, and then I started making these bridges because we have to get over here. I'm not sure exactly how I want to do it yet. I think I'm going to bring a triple bridge across right in here somewhere. 
Uh, maybe right in here, wherever that happens to line up. Uh, that might actually work out pretty good. Bring a triple bridge. I'll slap a drawbridge down. And then in here we can build our castle maybe. I don't know. It could be fun. I probably am going to need more walls. I don't know though. I mean, I made them too thick. Yeah, I'm not sure. But we can demo all of this for now. Just get it out of here. Oops. Lovely. 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 Okay. So, there's that. Um, and I guess what I'm going to work on right now is I'm just going to get a big room. I'm just going to get a big room set up over here. Um, I can't quite remember how big they can go. I think this was the maximum size. However big this is. Can I get a measurement? Give me a measurement, please. What is this? No, no, not like that. Not like that. Tw 22 by 17? I'm not really sure. M maybe I'm wrong. Maybe that was not the maximum size. I don't know. Let's, um... Let's figure it out. I think these things require walls. They don't really tell you if they do or not. I'm pretty sure they do. Let me just let me just build a big a big room. We'll put walls down as we need them. Not a problem. Let's do it. All right. So perhaps that's a good starting point and I just realized I don't have enough brick walls. We're going to have to upgrade these at some point, but I'm not going to make blueprints now because I don't want to deal with the lag. Everything seems to be working just nice right now, so we're going to we're going to roll with it. So I need to put walls up. Actually, let's go right across and then somewhere in here. I think it was actually there. Got to put the door. I'll probably want a door on each side of this room. I don't know for sure. More doors is better than less doors, in my opinion. Put those down. All of this is subject to move here very soon. So, let's start with the hats. Because, I, I, I mean, we gotta start somewhere. <laughs> so, I'll leave a one space around the perimeter. And how many things do these take? I've got two, four, six, eight. So we need three rows of eight and then a row of five. I would like to lay the bench out similar to how it's laid out here. I know we're gonna unlock more benches. Oh man, we're probably gonna unlock more hats, which is gonna mess this up. Well, for now, I think I want to lay it out like that just so that it's easier for me to set it up. And then I can worry about how I'm going to do the rest of it after. So do I have room here for three, four, five, six? No, I don't. I don't have room. It's fine. Uh, uh, something like this? Okay. Two, four, six. I need two more. Still didn't leave enough room. Damn, I gotta move it over two more. And I just realized I made this room way too deep. Because I only need four rows for hats. Well, three and a bit rows for hats. I think it was... Three full rows and then four? Five. Three full rows and then five. Man, we're gonna need more of these benches, I think. So I got those hats, those hats. Oh, guys. I need room for storage. 
I think I want to set it up similar to my robot spot. So you go in, you put it, and then you just drop it into the thing right beside. So that means I actually have to go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight over. Okay. There we go. So we've got this room set up. It's a proper size. I think in the future, if I make the other hats, or when I make the other hats, I'll probably just put them in a separate room so that we can know that they're the wonder items, maybe? Uh, and then it doesn't mess up this room, either. I, I think. I don't know. We'll have to figure it out. For now, this is going to work out just fine. I'm going to need a whole bunch of chests, though, and I don't... Oh, we've got tons. Although that's not really enough. Actually, it is. We have 80 items or something like that. And we need three per, so that should work out perfectly. Oh, no. What? It, it's not going to work out perfectly. Well, what was that? 180? Yeah, we're not going to have enough. Oh, crap. I put this in the wrong spot. For some reason, I was thinking 60 times 3 and 180, but it's not, uh, it's not right. So there we go. All the hats are in there, but we'll have, okay, we'll have enough for this room at least, for sure. Uh, yeah, let's go right like this. I like it. Ta-da! Okay, so now, I know when we were looking at these hats last time, they took extra stuff. So wool, not a problem. Okay, we're gonna have to start getting wood. We're gonna have to start getting wood brought up here. And I think... I have trains. I have trains already set up to get, like, the raw wood materials. But I don't really have any to get these things. And I'm not sure I want to. Because it's starting to get really messy. Um, hmm. I could come in here and around to start dropping off resources. What do I have for train parts right now? Not much. Not much at all. Hmm. Okay, interesting. So, all right, let me let me just start up a little notepad here. I got to start taking notes of what we have to bring up here. Okay, wool, I'm just going to go and get. Square frames and planks. Then we got bulrush, I'm just going to go get. Okay, all that stuff I'm just going to go get. Wool, whatever. Okay, we already got those. Got that. Whatever. Wool, bulrush. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Planks, poles, and fixing pegs. Okay, we've already got planks. We're going to need poles and fixing pegs. Then we got some more cloth. Cloth. Got that stuff. Got that stuff. Got that stuff. Yep. Paper. Oh, paper. <laughs> oh, no, paper. Okay. Um, got that stuff. Yep. 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 Okay. Okay. Metal plates and crude torches. Metal plates... Crude torches. So, to get every single one of these hats being made right now, the way things are, I will have to bring up seven new resources, and all the rest of them, the bots are just gonna have to run around and get. So, I got. Yeah, I've got string and thread over here. Does that turn into fabric? I'm not even sure anymore. I'm not in the right spot. Clothing. String. Thread. I'm not sure it does. 
All right, so I'm pretty sure it doesn't. So we don't have to do anything with that. I don't think for now. <laughs> Subject to change. So um, seven items. I'll probably put them in the big chests. Maybe. Uh, how am I even going to have room? I could actually, you know what? I could do something like this. Although, this is only five, and it took up a lot of room. Uh. <laughs> we are going to have to come down and get paper, too, which I don't have a spot set up for. So I might just make a train stop right here. That's not so bad. And then they're going to come around, up, probably stop at the train fuel station come up here around and then into here oh my god this is gonna get messy i need to make train parts for sure for now though um for now maybe i'll just get bots moving stuff because i don't have the train parts and i don't want to start building them right now because the lag is going to be unreal i think what i will do is lay out the basic track because we do have that set up and i needed six of these no seven of them maybe i'll leave a space as well that so we can get a road up behind there we'll give our bots lots of space to run around two four six seven all right that should work nicely this in here and then yeah i gotta just put some roads in between here now, I should get these trees out of here. Because they are going to be in the way of my train yard. Get the heck out of here. I don't have a broom. I don't have a broom. Oh, but we do have... The garburator. Okay, let's put this stuff... Not that. Let's put this stuff away. Get it out of here. All right. Problem solved. Let's get rid of that. Now, if I want to run a train track, I think it's going to be something like this. Ah. Uh, no, 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 no. How am I going to do this? Do I want a bunch of individual train things? I think I do. Okay, let's... Let's see. How much room did these need? Oh, I left a lot of room. They didn't even need these last few. One. One. One, two, three, four. Uh, if I go five straight sections, two, four, five straight sections. And then should I have them right beside each other? No, 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 I shouldn't. Okay, because we need to get those other things in there. Right, right, right. Okay, so if I do this, we're going to need two, four, six, seven of them. Five, six, seven. Okay, that will fit. That will fit. It's not the worst. And then, how did I do this part? Did I just use a whole bunch of these? Yeah, I just, <laughs> I just used a whole bunch of these. And some of them don't actually go anywhere. But that's fine. I put one, and then another one, and then another one. Yeah, okay. So that works. 
So we just keep going like this until eventually they're all connected. And then I think I'm gonna run out of parts, but that's fine. All right. So here's our, the beginning of our train yard anyway. And actually, we don't need these to be this long. I can just have little spots like this. Oh yeah, that'll save us a lot of stuff. Each train will have its own little area to go to. Oh, I like that much better. It'll use up a lot less tracks. So something like that. Maybe, and then I forget, after the train station, is it just five? Train station, one, two, one, two, three, four, yeah, it's five. So I put the train station down, one, two, three, four, five. Something like that. Then I'll have another train station. Apparently it doesn't work there. Or there. Okay. Then I gotta go one, two, three, four, five. Okay. And then another train station. Perfect. Let me just copy this up there and I'll see you soon. All right, so there is our train yard, I think. Square pegs, uh, square frames rather, planks, holes, fixing pegs, paper, metal plates, crude torches. Okay, so we've got all of that stuff in here now. I just seen that I'm missing a little bit of road here. And I wonder if I should build roads to all of these trains as well. You know, just to help unloading. I don't know, it's kind of messy. Maybe I'll just leave it. I'll leave it for now. And the other thing that we have to do is I'm thinking I want to have a bot. Do I want to have a bot bringing items? to a central hub somewhere, like all of the wool and the bulrush stuff, or do I want them just to go and get it themselves? Maybe I'll just get them to go get it themselves. We're not gonna need that many of these things. So they can just go to the source and grab whatever it is they need. The only problem is if like they have to come over here and get this and then run over here and get this, it might get a little bit messy. But, I don't know. I don't really want another storage with string, you know? I don't know. I don't think I do. I'm pretty sure I don't. <laughs> I don't know. I'm open to ideas, suggestions. But I think it's probably better for me to just run the bots wherever they have to go to get items and then deal with that stuff after. So there is that. There's my train yard set up. It's ready to go. I don't really feel like programming all those trains right now, so I don't think I'm going to, but I'll probably do it before the next episode. And I guess what we could start working on next is just taking a look at the layout for the next clothing, because we're probably going to have to do something similar. I might build another room up here and then maybe we'll leave enough room for another train yard and then I don't know where I'll come in I can like branch off here and and come around I don't know we'll have to see let's um first thing plunk a sewing station down and see how many things oh these take power I'm gonna have to put it in this room. Let's go take a look at how many things I can make in that in that right now. I'm seeing two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen, eighteen, twenty things. Oh god, I'm hearing the robot. 
What are you doing? Why are you holding that last piece of cotton? There's no way he should have left with a piece of cotton. How did you do that? Yeah, it's missing one. It just like... It got to this point... And then just went straight to this point. On the last... Time only. Not sure why you did that, little buddy. But I will finish it myself. Ta-da! Oh yes, we're rolling in the monies now. How much is all this stuff? Whoops. I always forget. No, wrong spot. I feel like they're like around 10... Around ten dollars. Yeah, ten, ten, ten. Ten, ten, twenty, thirty. Okay, it starts to get up there again. Oh my god. The pets are three hundred dollars. Oh man, that's gonna take a while. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. So yeah, see, I'm seeing here some of these things do go into the hat making bench, so there's also rocking chair stuff. Okay, so let me just see. Is this just for string? Or does this have clothes in it? Okay, just for string. So we're done with those things. We don't need them anymore. How about this? Do we make clothing? No. Okay, good. So we're done with those. Rude loom? Are we even using these anywhere? I don't even think we're using these anywhere. Okay, we don't need those. I guess we probably don't need them because we've got the powered looms, right? Yeah, that's right. Uh, these... Oh, these do make clothing. Okay. And they actually use other clothing as well. So we're going to need two, four, six more of these power looms, which, okay, we've got them. We got them here. I might just put them down so that I can keep track of what we're doing. Okay, I need six more of those. What else is there? Rocking chairs? Two, four, six, eight, ten, eleven. I don't... Oh, I do. I definitely have enough rocking chairs. Okay, so we'll need 11 of these bad boys. I'm gonna need room... I'm gonna need room... in between these for storages again. <gasps> Although, does the tier... I think these bigger clothes... Oh, yeah. See, they actually need the large storage. Uh, interesting. Interesting, interesting. Okay, maybe we won't worry about the powered looms right now then. Because I'm going to have to figure out where I actually want to put them. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, God, I'm all over the place right now. There's way too much to consider for this build. So none of these take weird stuff, right? It's all just clothing materials. Go with some straw. Although straw is... Well, it's not that far away. I don't think I'll use a train. I might just use a bot with a backpack. It's not that far. Uh, I mean, I do have a train station already set up here. So all I have to do is build an unloading spot. Uh... I don't know. We'll worry about that after. So, since I don't need any weird material for this room, I think what I'll do... Do these need flooring? They don't need anything? Yo, these don't need anything? Okay. Well, if they don't need anything, except for material, maybe I'll just kind of tuck it... Where will I tuck it? I want to tuck it somewhere out of the way a little bit 
in here. I don't know. Maybe that's not the worst. I need 11 of these things. Is that what I said? I don't even remember anymore. The problem is other clothing is going to need the items from here. So maybe I should keep it closer. Like we'll put it in here. We'll tuck them, we'll tuck them away like that. And then I'll get some storages. Nope. Some storages. Like that. And hope it doesn't cover up my doorway. Looks like it's not going to. I don't even know how many of these I put down. I didn't count. Okay, let's see here. I need ponchos, jumpers, tunics, uh, little sundresses, toga, robe, what is this one? A cello. Okay, and this is where all the straw stuff is starting. And I'm gonna need a few more chairs. Where's the clothing stuff? No, game. I didn't want that to happen. What did I just make? Farmer's hat? Jay. Wigs. <laughs> okay. So, there we go. That's all of the... That's all of the basic clothing station clothes. And then eventually there's going to be more. So there's going to be five more things that require clothing station in the future. I wonder if I should just put them down now. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, so that's it for our clothing station. That should be all of them that we're going to need, even future-proofed. Oh my gosh, this is turning into a mess. <laughs> okay, 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 it's fine, it's fine. Um, yeah, this is good. This is really good. So, now... Do these things require walls? I feel like they do. Sewing station. Oh my god. I basically need this room all over again. And I just want to check... If any of these require a sewing station. Okay, so there's no more sewing stations, but there's 15 more of these hat things. So we're, at some point we're going to need another room with 15 more hats. And it might just end up being over here. Those will be like our upgraded tier hats. And there's no more sewing stations. So if we get that room set up right now, then we won't have to worry about it again. Now the question I have is, do any of these take weird stuff? I got buttons. Buttons is a little bit weird. I'll have to bring them up from somewhere. I think it's just buttons okay so it's just buttons so that's really good because 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 I only need one extra train I only need one extra train one extra train okay okay so I can actually just bring a train right down in here. Well, I mean, I could also just have buttons getting stored over here. Do I have a chest over here with buttons in it already? I have a little one. How hard are buttons to make? 
Should we just make some buttons up there? I don't even remember. It's just fixing pegs. It's just fixing pegs, and we're already bringing fixing pegs up here, so maybe I will make buttons. And we'll just put them right here. What do you guys think of that? I'm already bringing fixing pegs wherever they're gonna be. I think I like that idea. Then it saves me a train. I like it. I think we're gonna do that. Come on, let me get behind here. And I won't need much. Like if I have a few guys over here making... Come on. If I have a few guys right in here making buttons, I think it was a wood shaping. Oh, but these have to be inside, don't they? No. No, they don't. Is, is that what I needed to make buttons? Yeah, it is. Okay, so they, yeah, we can just make a few of these. Make a bunch of buttons. I like that. That's good. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay, so let me just really quickly lay out another room here. If I have enough flooring, I don't think I will. Let me see. I'll try it. All right, so we've got the room here set up. I ran out of walls partway through. Um, and I also ran out of storage chests partway through. But... Other than that, I think this room is going to be good. Oh, I didn't actually make it long enough. I need one more set of storages over there. That's fine. I'm gonna move that wall pretty easy. <laughs> no. Clowns, dungarees. Awesome. So there we go. The infrastructure for our robot clothing factory has been completed. I just have to get the resources over here and get the bots programmed. And, man, I don't think I'm going to make you guys watch me do most of that. I think I'm just gonna kind of do it on my own. Just because I mean, it's gonna be a whole lot of the same thing over and over. You guys, I know some people think this game is tedious. Well, that is going to be tedious, but <laughs> once it's done, that's it. That's it. Once this is done, we've built, well, except for the stuff that I haven't unlocked yet. But once that's done, we've built everything, guys. Again, except for the stuff I haven't unlocked yet. Check it out. That is today's build right there. Oh, it's lovely. It's so good. Then after that, we're going to have to build a castle. We're going to have to get some little villages set up somewhere. Still haven't quite figured out exactly how I want to do that. We got some spaces that we can kind of fill up. Have some fun with. And uh, that might wrap up the mega base series guys i'm not exactly sure we are producing way more power than we're using that is good 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 awesome okay so guys i hope you liked this epic mega awesome close infrastructure build and if you did don't forget to leave me a thumbs up on this video subscribe to my channel if you're new here and guys if you have friends who like autonauts make sure you share my channel with them i need more people to see this who else does this i don't think anybody <laughs> <laughs> I don't think anybody else is stupid enough to do this, but here I am. I've done it So yeah, anyways guys, thanks for tagging along with me this far in the series and uh, Yeah, I'll see you next time